Hey, this is Vegeta, the Prince of All Saiyans, and this is SSJ Goshen 4. Her figures are over 9,000! Hey guys, it's S Goshen 4 here, back again with another review for you guys. And today, I'm reviewing the S Cultures Series 6 Super Saiyan 3 Goku. This one is doing the Kamehameha pose. There's another one that's just standing. My opinion, this is the better one. But yeah, this is by Ben Presto. And I actually received this figure from Nanoma. They're awesome for providing me this figure. And they're also giving me a discount code for you guys to use on their site. 30% off. 30, not 25 or not 20, 30% off. All S Culture Series 6 figures. So I'll put the link and the coupon code in the description so you guys can get your own for 30% off. But yeah, let's get started with this review. Alright, so the box, I like the box. I like that purple color scheme. Like, it looks different. It stands out, actually. It makes the figure stand out right there. I like how they have that nice image of the Super Saiyan 3 Goku on the front. Right here, we see more of the figure. Different shot of him on the side. On the back, we see the chrome version of this figure as well and the colored version and of course some info in Japanese right there in the bottom and on this side I really like this image it's of um, a really close-up shot of the Goku figure of his face and it looks badass in my opinion I really really like this picture and right here it's just the top of the box saying the same kind of info Ben Presto figure Coliseum S Culture 6 Toei sticker and etc all right guys so now that we looked at the box let's take this figure out okay so when we open the box Basically, it comes in these different pieces that we have to put together. Head goes right on here. Just pop it on. And the same goes with the stand. He has the pegs on the bottom. You kind of just put it in, in its place like that. And place the stand accordingly so you can make it stand up. It's pretty simple. Alright guys, so here is the figure assembled and outside the box. And I love it, in my opinion. I really like how they don't have too, too much detail in these. It's different. Like, it seems like every S Cultures is a little different with how they do the paint job, with how they even do the plastics and everything. It's just, and the sculpting. I mean, compare this one to the first series, so it looks completely different to that Super Saiyan 3 Goku. But yeah, so there isn't too much detail on the paint or the plastic, but I think it adds to, like, the anime-like looking figure. Like, it looks like it's from the anime because it doesn't show too 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 much like detail in the coloring which I don't really mind like it's different it's it, you know it's like a different different kind different kind of figure and then we see right there like a straight on shot which looks really cool so let me take a closer look at it alright so this is like a close-up shot of his face I think it looks freaking cool like I like that that pose like it looks like he's just about to charge and fire at you with that Kamehameha it looks so cool. I like like that smirk expression like heh, I'm gonna I'm about to beat your ass kind of face. We look even closer, we see the details on his hair and all the spikes. Looks like they're kind of moving in the wind almost. See right there the detail on his body. See all the creases on his gi. Looks really nice. We see on this side, look at all the detail on his hair I like that I like how they just added all the spikes the sculpting of the hair is really cool it's really hard to sculpt the Super Saiyan 3 hair right because I've seen it done terribly in some figures now here's a back view all the spikes really nice in the hair I like the pose a lot and now one more time for this side, right here on the Goku. See the detail on his hands too. I like how they add those little, like every wrinkle on the hand and everything. Okay guys, so now that I showed you that, let me show you how tall he is. So with the base, his last spike touches a little bit over 7.5 or just at 7.5. Without the base, He's just a little bit, I believe, over seven, a little bit over seven. Seven or a little bit over seven. Decent size for a figure. So now, lastly, let me show you a 360 view of him. Okay. 
Okay guys, so that's it. That's my review on the Fighting Post Super Saiyan 3 Goku from S Culture Series 6. I think this is a better one. I don't really like the Standing Pose one. I like this one better. And like I said, Nanoma is providing me a discount code for you guys. So yeah, when you click the link below in the description, it'll lead you to Nanoma's site. And in checkout, please copy the discount code and you get 30% off any S Culture Series 6 figure, which is awesome. I mean, 30% off. And the code is valid one week from the day this video is posted. Make sure you order your S Culture's figure before the week is over. Thank you again to Noma for providing me this figure and I hope you enjoyed this review and until my next video guys, peace.